hands folded in quiet resignation, joined in religious adoration, applying years of education, and practicing medical dedication. These hands, along with hearts and minds, come together in a clerkship that takes USF Medical School students out of the classroom and into the homes of terminal patients receiving hospice care. By going out to these homes of patients who have illnesses, you kind of are forced to look at every aspect of a patient rather than just the illness. Over 1,200 USF students have taken part in the mandatory program since it started in conjunction with Life Path Hospice in 1995. I'm very appreciative of the fact that the College of Medicine sees fit to have us have these experiences and kind of understand that you know there are still things that you can do for, for your patients after you've exhausted all of your medical options. The students are accompanied on their visits by a nurse and a social worker, giving them a more complete picture of the services that hospice offers. It doesn't just provide medical care, it also involves psychosocial factors, spiritual um, involvement and other factors that are more important to the patient just other than just curing them. And by helping these patients and their families, sometimes by simply listening to them, the hope is these students become empathetic physicians. They don't like to think about the end of life all that much, which is natural. But they're going to be doctors soon. They're going to have to deal with it. And I think that this really helps to prepare them. For University Beat, I'm Mark Schreiner. For more information on this University Beat or to view previous segments, log on to WUSF.org and click on the University Beat link.